Tampa Union Station is an Italian Renaissance revival style building that was designed by an architect from Wilmington, North Carolina. It was owned by the Tampa Union Station Company and opened on May 15, 1912. Tampa Union Station served railroad passengers through the Great Depression, both World Wars, and into the Amtrak era. Along the way in 1974, it was added to the National Register of Historic Places. Throughout the 1950s, federal investments in highways and air travel began to undermine Tampa Union Station's future. Passenger train ridership began to decline heavily during the 1950s. The trend continued throughout the next two decades. As passenger train ridership fell over the years, Tampa Union Station began to suffer from deferred maintenance. By the 1980s, the roof of the old depot leaked, plaster fell from the ceiling on a regular basis, and paint peeled throughout the prowl terminal. Tampa Union Station closed to the public in 1984. For the next 14 years, Amtrak passengers had to use a temporary make-do ticket office and waiting room in a prefabricated building adjacent to the station platforms. Thanks to local historic preservationists and passenger rail advocates, Tampa Union Station began its long path back to restoration. In 1988, the nonprofit Tampa Union Station Preservation and Redevelopment Inc. was founded. Their goal was to raise grant money for restoring Union Station. Also that year, Tampa Union Station helped to foster a citywide conversation about preserving the past. It was one of the first buildings to be designated a Tampa landmark under the City of Tampa's new Historic Preservation Ordinance. In 1991, Tampa Union Station Preservation and Redevelopment Inc. acquired the station via a mortgage held by CSX, the corporate descendant of its original owners. Led largely by volunteers, they raised more than $4 million for the building's restoration. Restoration of Tampa Union Station was a multi-year effort with rural architects serving as historic preservation architect for the project. Restoration was completed in May 1998. The station has been reopened to Amtrak passengers ever since.